I'm just gonna make a quick video, man. I did not know this, right? Listen to me. Y'all know I've been talking about how the girl situated between September and October in Pego 2 is what I'm talking about. And how the symbolism of the apple and the honey ties into Rosh Hashanah and how she's sitting on the top of an eclipse. Well, I didn't know there is actually an eclipse this year during Rosh Hashanah. On October the 2nd, there's going to be an annular eclipse during Rosh Hashanah. And I looked up the path of the eclipse and it's going over Easter Island. Well, if you if you see right before the Antichrist comes out of that devil's head cave, you can see the little blue figure, the guy with the changing mask, he's dancing around and behind him you can actually see the Easter Island statues and the Easter Island statue. Uh, and that's what it is. And it, it's dark and then all of a sudden it becomes light. Why? It's an eclipse happening over Easter Island. That's where this eclipse occurs during Rosh Hashanah. So whatever other events it's talking about, and I do believe it is talking about this coming up eclipse as well. I'll talk about that later. But man, whatever else we surmise, the eclipse that happens on Rosh Hashanah over Easter Island is a primary emphasis of Pego 2. Absolutely. So, uh, I appreciate that user who pointed that out. I didn't know there was an eclipse coming up on Rosh Hashanah. So, Rosh Hashanah, the apple, the honey, she's holding the apple. She's surrounded by that honey. She's got honey in her hand. It's on Rosh Hashanah because on Rosh Hashanah, the Jews dip apple in honey. It's their way of, you know, saying the new year. That's their new year is going to be sweet. It's just a tradition, the apples and honey. That's what it ties into. And there's an annular eclipse happening on Rosh Hashanah. So that eclipse, the apples and the honey in October. She's right between September and October. That's it, man. On Easter Island. That's it, man. So, uh, it's, it's heading up to that. That's going to be a climactic event. This is the year, guys. This is the year.